Google sends out invites for an October 29th event, Nokia's quarter results disappoint, and Apple has to publicly apologize to Samsung. I'm Jaime Rivera, wondering where I'll be on October 29th, and this is Pocket Now Daily. That's right, believe it or not, a UK appeals court has just determined that Apple's accusations against Samsung for copying their products isn't true. As a result, Apple is forced to push ads on their UK website and probably elsewhere, apologizing to Samsung for the accusations. Talk about a way to bite your own bullet, but I was expecting a little more drama, probably building some Samsung license plates or something for a year. Now, Nokia, on the other hand, isn't having so much fun. The reason quarter results were just published, and aside from losing $750 million, they've also dropped Lumia sales by 30%. Now, this is completely understandable because we all know that current Lumias won't be getting Windows Phone 8, so I know a lot of loyalists just moved away and waited for the Lumia 920 to come out. But again, they're waiting for Windows Phone 8, which couldn't come out any sooner. Now, Google has finally done a logical thing that I don't know why other companies haven't done before. I think only Amazon's figured out the fact that we need a wish list. And Google has brought a wish list now to the Google Play Store. Just think about it. How important is a wish list? What do you do to remember all the apps that you've wanted to purchase during the month whenever your paycheck arrives? I'm always writing them down. So the update should be available for your phones and tablets right now and check it out. Now, Acer has just announced their 7-inch tablet competitor to go against the Google Nexus 7, and it's called the Acer Iconia Tab A110. It brings some decent specs along with Android 4.1 Jelly Bean out of the box, and it retails for $220 in the United States. Now, sadly, we've never had good experiences with Acer tablets in the past, so if I were you, I'd wait and see. Give it a try first. And finally, for the competing news of the day, Google has just sent out press invites for an October 29th event to be held in New York City and focus on Android. And yes, believe it or not, that's the same date that Microsoft is going to launch Windows Phone 8 in San Francisco. Kind of coincidental, but hey, Google is planning to launch their Nexus, or probably Nexus devices, in this event and will be there to cover it live. That leads me to the question of the day. What would be your dream Nexus device to be launched in this event? In my particular case, I would love an HTC J Butterfly Nexus device, so leave us a comment down below. And if you want an earlier scoop of everything that's happening in the smartphone and tablet world, make sure you follow us on Pocketnow.com. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I'm Jaime Rivera. Thanks for watching.